France officially announced its intent to procure two Saab Global I Airborne Early Warning and Control AEWNC, aircraft, with the possibility of acquiring two more in the future. This decision, unveiled at the Paris Air Show 2025, marks a key milestone in the French Air and Space Force's efforts to upgrade its airborne surveillance and command infrastructure. Although the purchase agreement remains pending, the French Defense Procurement Authority, DGA, confirmed that the notification phase is active and a formal contract is anticipated shortly. The Global I system, designed to thrive in contested and electronically challenging environments, boasts a radar detection range exceeding 650 kilometers and an impressive flight endurance of over 13 hours. This allows it to cover extensive operational areas during a single sortie. Built on the Bombardier Global 6000-6500 business jet airframe, the aircraft integrates advanced sensor suites, including the Ari ER Active Electronically Scanned Array, AESA, radar, Leonardo Seaspray 7500E Maritime Radar, the Fleur Star Sapphire 380 HD Electro Optical Turret, and a Ground Moving Target Indicator, GMTI. These technologies collectively deliver comprehensive real time battlefield awareness to command centers, enhancing France's tactical agility and strategic decision making. France's move to acquire the Global I stems from the need to replace its aging Boeing E 3F Sentry fleet, which has served since the 1990s but is becoming increasingly costly to maintain. While alternative options like the Boeing E 7A Wedgetail, used by the UK and NATO, were evaluated, concerns raised by US defense authorities affected its prospects. Ultimately, France favored Saab's Global Eye for its proven operational readiness, advanced technology, and multi-domain surveillance capability. In a notable industrial development, Saab signed a framework agreement with the French company Sabina Technics to manage local customization and after-sales support, signaling a commitment to integrate the platform within France's defense industrial ecosystem. This selection explicitly rules out Dassault Aviation's Falcon 10X-based proposal for a domestic AEWNC solution. Dassault CEO, Eric Trappier, criticized the choice, emphasizing France's existing aerospace expertise and warning against reliance on foreign systems. Despite this, the DGA prioritized a mature and field-tested platform, which underwent trials at the Air and Space Force's Montemarsan Test Center in April 2024. The procurement of Global Eye also reflects a broader trend of strengthening Franco-Swedish defense collaboration. On the same day, both nations signed a joint declaration of intent targeting cooperation in missile systems, including Acheron MP, Meteor, and Aster, and naval technologies. This strategic alignment aims to build a robust European competence center for critical surveillance capabilities. By adopting the Global Eye, France embarks on a crucial upgrade of its airborne command and control assets, ensuring the nation's military remains effective in complex and modern warfare scenarios. The program underscores France's pursuit of strategic autonomy and deepens its technological partnership within the European defense landscape.